All right, guys. So I was looking for an image to tie to this, and this actually, if this offends you, I apologize. I, it's actually kind of my attitude is, yeah, you have a rough streak. And actually, you know what's interesting? Yeah, you're having a rough streak. You're watching this. And it's interesting how the human tendencies work. Whether you're having a rough streak or a winning streak, the natural human tendency is the same is to stop doing Weird, huh? But for different reasons. Um, but you're having a rough streak? Yes, that's all it is. Streaks end. And the quickest way to have that streak end is, let's say you talk to, I don't know, 20 in a row. And they say, no, you screened them out. You know the only way for that streak to end is A, cry about it for days on end, B, get to another POC, or C, get to another POC. Um, you have a 66% chance of getting that right. But this is my attitude, is every person I speak to gets me one step closer. I didn't always have this attitude, but when you... It's hard to do and adapt this this mindset is it's whether it's a good streak or a bad streak, it will come to an end. But guess what? The more you do with consistent inputs and all the variables in place, but the more you do, the more results you get. That's it. So you're having a bad streak. You push through. Now, you may want to take a break take a brief break man and then get back on it um me i i just do 45 minutes to 90 minutes more likely like 60 minutes straight on the phone i don't take breaks on good or bad sometimes booking a demo I'll come in and say tell barry another demo for you to do bitch but really it's um or when i break the ice maybe i'll take a quick two minute break um it feels good after about three hours and you book a demo but the thing is I finally got momentum going. Why am I going to stop? No, get back on the phone. Break through. And it will balance out. Once you master the steps and you have it down, the more you do, the more you'll get. Now, initially, as you are getting it down, the results may vary. But over time, it doesn't matter whether I do five hours or 50 hours, the ratios stay the same. Yeah, there's going to be up streaks and down streaks and all of that, but it stays the same as far as ratios are concerned. Once you actually get things down and you're doing it consistently the same way, relatively the same, not all conversations are the same, um, especially with Barry because he actually talks about like uh, he'll get a CEO on the phone to talk about like dissolving people in a bath of lie. It's actually kind of interesting. True story when he was on Next Track, by the way, as a sales director. Uh, the guy's name was Jonah. He's from Covidian. Um, but anyway, so you're having a bad streak. Give us a call. You know what? Let's say you talk to some some dicks. You nominate him for dick of the day. Get back on it. The only way to end a bad streak is on the phone. But don't let that – don't be a prisoner in your own head. Don't think because you've talked to 10 dicks in a row – you're going to be talking to 10 more dicks. No, that just means you got the dick, your dick quota out of the way and you're actually going to, you're actually going to be, it's going to turn around. You're one call away. Now, if you're thinking about, and this is hard to do, easier said than done, by the way, is you're, you're taught, you 10 in a row and you're like, man, the 11th is going to be bad. You get in that mindset, guess what? You're thinking it. And it will be delivered. So keep pushing forward. You're only one call away from turning it around. So, and you, you need to uh, give us a call. We're happy to work through it. We will call. We'll go ahead and have some fun, and we'll we'll nominate a dick of the day with you on Facebook or whatever. So, push through that rough streak. It will come to an end.